Hey, this is Wilson, and today we're going to talk about the two things that you need to get the best wedding photos possible. The two things to get the best wedding photos possible are good light and clean backgrounds. First, I'll go over good light. When indoors, you want natural light from big windows. You want to turn off the room's light, even if it looks too dark sometimes, it'll look great on camera, I promise you that. When you have an overcast day, good lighting is kind of everywhere because the light is even in every single direction, which makes it super easy to shoot with. Now, if you don't have an overcast day, things can get a little trickier, though most photographers should be able to figure this out pretty easily. If it's sunny and you're getting photos done outside, you want to be looking for shade. Going in the shade essentially eliminates all cast shadows because you are going into the shadow itself. If you do have a sunny day, the best time for photos is sunset, or as you may have heard the term used before, golden hour or magic hour. During that time, the light is super warm and it's also not as harsh as it is during the daytime. Now I understand logistically how this can be tricky because golden hour in the summertime is typically when you'll be having your reception dinner. So it is hard to kind of get photos around that time for a summer wedding. However, if you can, I do recommend sneaking out even for just five, 10 minutes, whatever you can squeeze to get out some photos during that time. The second thing you need to get good photos is clean backgrounds. Just an environment where you don't have anything distracting going on. So in terms of getting ready photos, a clean room. That's simply it. A clean room, a clean space to get ready in. In terms of portraits, having a clean background basically means having a space where there isn't a bunch of people walking around or anything moving in the background. If for portraits, you end up in a place where it isn't as quiet as you'd like. Having a skilled photographer can really help because they can make the place look like there's no one around at all and it's just you two. So there you have it. The two things you need for good photos. Good light and a clean space. That's it.